YouTube, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So as you can tell by the title, I have a luxury unboxing for you guys. I have been eyeing these sandals since last summer and I didn't get them because it was really hard for me to find them in my size. And this summer, I just knew I had to have them. Um, last summer, I only saw them in orange, but this year they came out with a lot more colors. So, I do have a Dolce & Gabbana unboxing for you guys. So, I have not seen anyone post these on YouTube. So, I think I'm the first. I'm not sure. So, this does come in two styles. One has a heel and one does not. So, I have the one that does not have the, have the heel. And before I actually take them out of the box, I'm going to go on the Dolce & Gabbana website and get the exact name and specs of this sandal so please hold so these are the dolce and gabbana calfskin sliders with dg logo um these retail for 545 on the dolce and gabbana website um and it's made in italy so i'm gonna be unboxing them for you guys just the regular black box that they come in and i'm gonna open it up and then I kind of opened them the day I got them home. So I do have the dust bags kind of thrown in here. And then when you open up the tissue, it exposes the mule. So I did get them in white. So they do come in. I'm just going to take this tissue out. They do come in white, black. Um, just an array of colors. Like I said, last year, I only saw them in orange. But this is the mule. So I did get them in the white, of course, obviously. And it has the new Dolce & Gabbana interlocking d g logo on the front. It is calfskin leather with a rubber sole. I did get mine in a size 42, which is an equivalent to woman's size 12. Um, and yeah, this is, and it says made in Italy on the bottom is script right here. This is the mule. So, I, as I said before, have been eyeing these. Like, these will be perfect for summer, perfect with a skirt, even really cute with a pair of cute jeans. I did get a cute pair of jeans to go with these. They're kind of, like, frayed at the bottom, but even a regular pair of really cute skinny jeans really cute, will look really good with these. I absolutely love them. I will be doing an on-foot um, shot, but I'm going to let you guys know how they run. So, these, if you can't tell by the sole, are really perfect for people with really narrow feet. I have a very narrow foot, but even for me, like, it's still, like, pushing it. Like, super narrow sole. That's, the, look at that. That's the only downside I would have to say there is to this shoe, is that the sole is so narrow. Like, it's crazy. Now, as far as the width goes, it is a bit snug in here. So I would say these run at least a half size small. I would say at least start with the half size up. Normally in women's sandals, I'm in between the size 11 and 12 anyway, mostly in 11, 11 and a half. And I got these in a the size 12, which is the largest size they make. And it was so hard to get that size. I had to have these shipped from Dallas, LA, to Atlanta for me to purchase them at the Atlanta store. Um, but yes, you guys, like if you, this is perfect for if you have a really narrow foot and this part does fit very snug. Again, try at least half a size up um, before you go ahead and purchase these. I will say that this is good quali quality leather. Um, the bottom is kind of hard and it has this really slither of a thin heel, if you guys can see that here. A small heel so it's not completely flat to the ground. I actually really do like that. I feel like with these, you can dress them up. You can dress them down. Um, I love the white on white stitching. And it is, if you can't tell in the camera, like, this is like a true white sandal. They're going to, like, these are going to, of course, I'm not going to wear them too, too often this sometimes because they are so white. But these are going to be able to go 
with any and everything you guys like i cannot wait to start in these this summer so now i'm going to go ahead and insert a clip of how they look on the foot um but again i will say these are very comfortable they're definitely not for a wide person with more of a wide foot they're super cute super comfortable you can always get this middle section stretched you can take it to a shoe shop um to do that or i, I heard there's like a spray you can get but also calfskin leather tends to stretch on its own as you wear them so you can even really stuff them to stretch them a little bit or just naturally wear them but nonetheless they're really comfortable again go ahead size up and i feel like you'll be good um i hope you guys enjoy this quick little unboxing of these shoes again i cannot wait to stunt in these this summer there's not much i can really say about them because i have not really worn them yet other than around my apartment um, but yeah, I haven't seen any videos on them. So I'm like, you know, I'd rather tell people how they fit before they go ahead and spend $600 on a pair of sandals. So let me know if you guys have any, uh, questions in the comments about these and I will go ahead, go ahead and answer them. I hope you guys love this video and please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe before you leave. I love you all to absolute pieces and I will see you guys in the next one. Mwah.